Hello, everyone. Dominic Crea here from the Justice Tech Pros podcast and from the We Push Back podcast. I wanted to do just a quick episode. Um, I just wanted to thank everybody who I got notification that the channel hit a thousand subs. And I just want to thank everybody for that. And what's really important to me also is the website is growing tremendously. The amount of hits uh, this last month and a half has increased dramatically. And it's all good stuff. It's all based on the exposure. And it's all based on, you know, um, people such as yourselves, everybody who helped share the channel. We had many content creators share the channel. Uh, from the beginning, I had a, a lot of original content creators sharing the channel, promoting We Push Back. And I don't want to start naming everybody because, to be honest, there's just too many people to thank. I mean, between supporters, content creators, everybody really who uh, believed in We Push Back really took an active role and, and really did what they could to bring exposure, and they continue to do that. So I thank everybody. I thank all the content creators, even the newer ones who lately been sharing to try to get us to break the thousand. I thank the newer ones uh, to get us those few subs to get over that hump. I thank all the uh, everybody who's been sharing it from day one just to get us to that. And um, I know, like, we broke a thousand, and I know some trolls will subs uh, subscribe, and then they'll take it away to make you look foolish if you do, like, a, a thousand episode uh a thousand subscriber episode, but that's not what this really is. I'm not doing a thousand subscriber episode. I'm just thanking everybody. And even if it drops past a thousand, the sentiment is still the same, folks. I just thank everyone for continuing to to bring attention to We Push Back. Um, most of the people got their hats who wanted them. A few over overseas in different countries probably didn't get them yet. But most of the people got them. I'll be getting pictures. I'm going to do another collaboration video showing everybody wearing their We Push Back hats, and I'm going to put it on the website as well. And, um, you know, the supporters are what, what make this thing. Everybody who's behind it, everybody who's pushing it, everybody who's hashtagging it, that's what's important. When everybody's doing that hashtag We Push Back, you're just bring, you're flooding the results, you're populating the SEO, you're bringing attention to the concept and to the channel, and in turn, brings exposure. So everything's working really well. Um, I'm actually very pleased at how things are coming together. Uh, 2023, like I spoke about, I have some other uh, higher level type uh, affiliations and some strategic alliances that I'm going to be putting together. And the, the focus, folk, folks, is really just getting that website and that database populated. I'm going to continue to put articles on these line informants, continue to show the... Um, court documents that the defense team puts in, uh, letters from the lying informants to the judge asking for uh, leniency, and then show that to their current behavior on YouTube. What we're trying to do here is tell a story, folks, and we're trying to educate the public and trying to educate future jurors, which is vital, so that defendants have a fair sh chance. And that's really all it's about. You just don't want to be up against lies. If you're going to face the criminal justice system, you want to be there based on things you actually did not things based on uh, lies that are people saying you did. And that's that's the focus here. And um, uh, informants are popping up on YouTube, and We Push Back welcomes them. Um, we're going to give you a nice welcome when you come on YouTube. We'll tell your story the best we can. <laughs> we're going to, uh, the same way you're telling stories about defendants, we're going to tell stories about your past, about your court records, your 302s. So there's a lot to come, folks. A lot's on the hopper. Um, again, this is a hobby for me. This ain't a full-time job. If it was a full-time job, we'd be much further along, but obviously things take priority. But I actually like the way this is going. It's going at a nice pace. Uh, it allows me to plan things out a little bit better. It allows me to strategically um, implement certain phases uh, with a little more ease. So I'm totally comfortable with the pace in which we're growing. And um, I made a little uh, blurb about it today on a post. I posted a, uh, something about the latest lying informant that we have come across. But uh, to be honest, folks, word's getting out there. I, I can't go into too much detail because a lot of this stuff, um, it's just a matter of you don't want to tip your hat, you know, to certain things. But all I could say is we were contacted. The last two weeks been tremendous. I don't know what happened these last two weeks, but the last two, two weeks, a big ip uptick in emails to my office and calls. Uh, a lot of defense teams inquiring about what we push back is doing, inquiring about the database, and um, they're going to need some information to help their uh, strategy for the defense when the time of litigation comes. So we're very uh, 
we're excited at the exposure. We're excited at the alliances that are coming in. And we're excited about the um, acknowledgement we're starting to get from different people in different aspects of law and different aspects of the legal world. And so far, it's been positive, been very positive. Um, I don't have to tell the com a person with common sense how valuable an asset such as we push back can be when you have a defendant who may be up against one of the lying informants in question. So uh, a lot of the defense, a lot of the lawyers, the attorneys, the defense teams who, who reached out, they see the value in that. And they understand it. So it's a win-win uh, for everybody. So really, folks, I just wanted to say thank you to everyone who took the time and continues to take the time to share the channel, talk about the channel, wear the hats, talk about it out in public, wear the shirts. Without all of you, none of this is possible. So again, I can't thank each and every one of you. There's just too many, which is a great thing. But I, uh, you all know who you are. You all know who took part. You all know who the original uh, We Push Back supporters were. You know who were the ones there when I started this thing uh, right by my side and continue to be by my side. And then we have some who aren't around no more. But that's good for me. That's like a cleansing. I like when things like that happen. It really gives you insight as to who's on board, who's not, who's for real, who's not, who believes, who don't. So you need that. You need that in any kind of um, any kind of... Uh, function of community or anything, a group project, anything where you're working together, uh, you, you need sometimes that cleanse really to see what you're dealing with and who, who you got supporting you and and uh, who really truly believes in what you're building and who don't. So again, thank you to everybody. <clears throat> I can't say it enough. Uh, I'm truly humbled by the positive reaction i always say it i thought i was going to see nothing but negative and i was ready for that so the positive aspect threw me a bit for a loop and i want to thank everybody for that and for all the haters the naysayers the ones oh they're not going to know what it is who was saying that one and a half years ago <laughs> boy were you guys wrong <laughs> and that's why i just kept my mouth closed and let you say whatever you wanted to say but all i could say is boy were you wrong on so many different levels so many different levels but I like that. We need that. I like, I've always been the type where I like the negativity. I like the doubters. I like the haters. Uh, it gives me the fuel I need. I, I, I don't know. I always liked proving people wrong, so it gives me a lot of fuel. And that's it, folks. Uh, thank you again. I truly appreciate it. Next stop, 2000. But what's more important, honestly, my focus, the, the, the channel's great. It's great for drum, uh, drumming up conversation, connecting with, with other content creators. But as everybody knows, we push back goes way beyond YouTube. This is about bringing exposure uh, to the biggest reach we could possibly tap into. And that's why the internet, the, the website is really the main module here. Everything else, the Twitter, the Instagram, the Facebook, uh, the YouTube, those are just arms of it. Oh, and for everybody who's not following We Push Back, if you're on Facebook, follow us on Facebook, uh, YouTube, uh, YouTube, obviously, uh, Twitter, and Instagram. So be sure to give us a follow and just start spreading the word. And if you believe in it, keep hashtagging We Push Back, keep sharing things that are posted up. Uh, share whatever's relevant to the cause, even if we push back, doesn't put the information out. If it's relevant, share it. If it's about lying informant, share it. Uh, just bring attention, folks. Just bring attention. Okay, I don't know why I just did the uh, fist there, but <laughs> it just popped up. But anyway, okay, everybody, have a good night, and thank you again. Till next time.